welcome back to another week. So as you could see from the beginning of this video, I have something new um, in the studio. So basically it's a fun story. It's not fun. It's just, yeah, <laughs> it's just a story. Uh, so my aunt that is, um, that lives next door from my parents' house, it's moving, so basically she has a lot of furniture and I got this one from her. I got two more and I'll use that to change like that part of the studio, like the, um, the other uh, side of the studio. So I'm really looking forward to it. I always wanted to have like a storage system like this and I think it really brightens up the space and yeah, I love it. I'm super happy how the studio is looking right now. I'm still like tweaking things and making it my own because this is my childhood um, bedroom. I have this bedroom since I was born and the furniture is exactly the same as when I was born. So yeah, I kind of want to change things now. And yeah, it's starting to come true and for free because <laughs> It was offered to me, so awesome. Now it's actually Tuesday and I already did some things for Patreon. I have to go record the podcast now, but this week something exciting arrived, as you can see in the back, so let me grab them. So I've ordered some tote bags. They don't fit in the picture, but yeah, I want to try them out with different designs. I think that'll be fun. And this week I also wanted to do like some new notepad covers to send to my manufacturer because I really want to do some new notebooks. I think the ones that I have done more recently are like almost one year old, probably. I made them probably last November, I think. So I really need to do that. Then I still want to add like the portfolio part on my website. Um, and I have three portraits to do, so I better get going <laughs> with work because, yeah, this will be last the last thing to do because it's just for fun to see how it goes. If it goes well, I'll just put them in the shop. So, yeah, I'll record the podcast now and then I'll go on with the portraits. I can't really show you because they are all gifts, gifts so... I hope I can draw something with you this week, but I'll keep you posted and at least you can see how I make my notepad covers. So yeah, I'll talk with you soon. Also, since I'm talking about like the history of my furniture, I think I've said on a previous vlog, this one was from my father and this thing over here, this didn't belong here, as you can see. This one was from like a bed, like the head of the bed like it was like this this part was this <laughs> and like when you lay in the bed you have like this just like for the bed not to end like yeah i don't know how to explain this belonged to a bed so i've just reused it as like a standing thing for the computer and to have more space and yeah could use like the whole table so little <laughs> information about the studio that one i bought and this one already existed over here it was from my sisters from like when they were studying i bought that one as well but everything else was already here when i was born so so yeah i don't know if you find that interesting but yeah <laughs> so i'll record the podcast now Hello there, welcome to Wednesday. So I don't know if you can see 
in the back, but the studio it's a little bit of a mess. I'm trying to change that part as well, so I showed you in the beginning of the video this side. So now I'm taking care of that side. Um, my mother needed some furniture in a room, so she's going to keep that one over there and the ones that I had on that corner, I don't know if you remember, but I did, I'm doing the portraits now and I can't really show you, but I can show you the final result of the drawing that you saw me making before. So I don't know if you remember, but I have like a personal project that I'm um, drawing emotions like little monsters. So I already have like the happy, the sad, the calm and the loved one. And today I did the fear one and I think it looks super cute. So I did like this and he has like a little monster picking him and yeah, I think it looks super cute. Um, I filmed a little bit of the process. Um, today it's been a lot about making portraits. I have three portraits to do as I told you before, but I need to take care of two orders that I got yesterday, I think. So I need to make more stickers because I haven't sold these stickers for the previous orders. So I basically just make them when I get orders. So I don't have them like a lot in stock. So I need to do that and some notepads because the notepad that I did, it's awful. I did it like in 15 minutes just to take the photos and put them in the shop update last week. So yeah, let's do that together. And I'm really sorry for the mess. That's everything that was in my drawers and now it's on top of the sofa. So yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> Welcome to Thursday. I'm currently taking a break from <laughs> the commissions, as you can say. As you can see, I'm all sweaty and gross. So I'm changing the studio again, like the other part that I told you before. Oh my god, everything's a mess. <laughs> Let me show you. So I unmounted like the sofa bed thing. Here were the printers. And this is the mess, guys. Yeah, <laughs> don't even know 
where to start. Um, so basically I have some furniture to put over there and another one to put over here and I'm going to put like the bed sofa thing over there so that I can have like a mini cozy space um, over there. Then I still need to work things out because let me show you. As you can see, it's a mess over here as well. This is like a storage house for me. Um, I'm putting everything on that side to see if the bed fits over here. So that I, I can have like a nice cozy thing during the winter. But yeah, this is the current state of things. As you can see, everything is a mess. So now I'm going to put all of that over here and yeah okay so this is the state of things right now i'm waiting for my sister's boyfriend to come to help me put the f new furniture here so yeah <laughs> it's weird to see this space so clean but i really liked it because one of the reasons that i'm doing this is because i film a lot from there to here and when i do that like the background is super dark and i really don't like it so i would like this part to be more white and clean and over here i'm going to put a new furniture as well it's not new it was also from my aunt that is moving so it's not basically new it's used and he has some damage but uh, I'll just need to rub it off a little bit and do a new paint layer someday not now because I'm tired of moving um, so yeah this one as well as you've seen from the beginning of this video so I will guess I'll keep you posted Later, my sister boyfriend will come to help me put like the furniture is on the basement. So I need to bring it upstairs. And I'm sorry for my hair and my face. I know I look a mess, but yeah. Um, and yeah, I'll keep you posted and I'll show you everything once it's done or almost done. Hello everyone, so yesterday I finished quite late like mounting the furniture um, The corner where the printers were are still not ready because the furniture is super heavy So I need to wait for my boyfriend to come and help with that um, And I'll show you in a little bit how the other corner where like the bed sofa was um, But yeah, I really need someone to explain how it's Friday already <laughs> because the week went off super fast and I didn't do what I was supposed to do and what I tell, told you in the beginning of the week so yeah, I thought today I could do a little break from the commissions during the morning and we could do the tote bags together so that's what we are going to do I still know if I'm going to mount the notebooks uh, with you but I'll still film it and probably post it in next week's studio vlog so yeah, let me show you how the studio it's looking. So here you go. Now you can see like the little little things. I had to put them up because otherwise I was just eating my face constantly on them. Um, so still don't know how to put them like on the side, but we'll see about that. And yeah, I think it looks super cute. I just don't like that box over there, but yeah, I had it to put it somewhere and I really like it. I think it looks very cute. It brightens the space. Now this corner over here, it's still a mess. I still need to put like the, um, the other furniture in here. Still don't know if I'm going to take the, um, the mirror or not, but we'll see about that. But yeah, I think it's looking super cute and nice. And I really love it. It's all coming together. And yeah, now I have these boxes over here. I still haven't shown you that. Instead of the other ones that I had before, now everything is more organized. And maybe I need to do another studio tour. So tell me what you think in the comments. In the future, I would like to paint those doors white because I think it will look more together because they look super, super dark. And yeah, tell me what you think. I really like how it's going and yeah. 
and now let's do some tote bags or try because I'm super afraid <laughs> it won't work but we'll see okay so this is printing now I had to flip like the image um, I don't know if this is going to work because I think you will notice like the um, the thing because you are supposed to cut like this around and I think you'll notice like the sheets of the transfer paper between this I don't know if I'm explaining correctly but yeah let's try it out it's about experimenting today and it's already printing over there so then we'll try to get the iron and put it in the bag to see how it works so you're supposed to iron it on for a little bit <coughs> and then I need to put the image face down and I need to use a piece of clothing on top Instructions are not clear at all, and this transfer to the t shirt that I'm using and not the other one. So, yay! <laughs> uh, okay, so I was putting this with like this, and it wasn't transferring, so I peeled this off, but then it just glue here and not on the canvas so uh. so I was doing this wrong obviously I went and watched a YouTube video and the piece of clothing is supposed to be below and not on top and now I have a shirt with a finish backwards but it's okay um, but it said it needed to be on a, on a flat surface so I figured yeah that the piece of clothing were supposed to be on top but whatever um, this is too crazy I think this will be super noticeable like the um, the white in here but let's try this out and we'll see so let's put this warm again So I just peeled this off and I totally forgot to film because I was so scared because I was ironing for a while and the image won't stick but then I realized the iron wasn't in the maximum thing and then it was super fast. Now I need to go over with this silicone thing just to fix the image for like washing and stuff and yeah. show you like how it looks so even though you can see like the um, like the where I've cut the sheet you can see from the shining I love like how you can have like the little details but yeah now I just need to see how it's better maybe I can print it will be a lot more work but maybe I can print and cut them on the silhouette and yeah then I can have like more going on on the back but yeah I really like the final result but yeah tell me what you think I think it looks super cute leave it in the comments what image you think I should do next um, I really love how you can see like the texture of the bag and the little things in here and 
yeah, just tell me what you think. I'll do more next week. I just wanted to try this out this week with you just to see if the sheets that I use work and everything. But yeah, just tell me in the comments and I can't wait to do more. end the studio vlog here I hope you really enjoyed this video even though I almost didn't do anything that I was supposed to and that I told you in the beginning of the video but I hope you still enjoyed it it was basically me packing orders and getting the stuff in the studio all together and yeah <laughs> I hope you still enjoyed it and if you like my videos, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and click on the bell button to receive notifications every time I post a video so you won't miss anything. And I hope next week the studio will be all ready with the other furniture in that corner over there. So if you want to keep being updated, make sure you follow me on Instagram as well for daily updates. And yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this vlog. I guess I'll talk to you again next week. Stay safe and have a nice week or weekend ahead. So, bye guys! Bye!